Okay, welcome to WHB.com. We're here talking with Kevin Seitzer, former Royals hitting coach. Big news today, the Royals have made some changes. That hitting coach, what are the emotions you're feeling today with this news that uh, Jack Maloof and Andre David are out? Well, you know, a little sad, a little surprised. I mean, sad from the fact that, uh, you know, I was hoping I would get the call to come back because I know the guys so well and, you know, I know the ropes of what they need to do to prepare every day. And um, But a little surprised that George was the guy that they brought in. But, you know, as far as the Kansas City Royals franchise goes, I think that's the best guy to bring in right now. Tell me how, how you have been watching Royals games this year. You're watching it as a former player, or you're watching it as a hitting coach, watching as the guys. I mean, has it been frustrating for you? It's been frustrating for a lot of fans, obviously. Yeah, I, I've been watching as a hit, former hitting coach, as their hitting coach, and kind of, you know, as my kids. Yeah, and that's the way I felt about them when I was with them every day. And, you know, at the same time, it, it, it saddens me, breaks my heart that I know I can help, and, you know, but there's nothing I can do. I just have to sit and watch it like everybody else. But, you know, you, you could sense that the frustration was rising and you see the guys and their approaches changing a little bit and there's more frustration in their at-bats and their body language and, you know, I, it didn't, didn't surprise me that there was a move made today. What's the toughest part for a, a young player who's struggling to try to get out of it? Because they get a lot of, you know, messages from a lot of different people. What, what's, what's the most difficult thing for a young guy to get through his head? when they're trying to get better? Well, you know, normally what they'll do is they'll start thinking about 27 different things that they can start changing with their swing, their mechanics, their, you know, and, and normally it usually comes down to simplifying things. And, and that's where the hitting coach comes in to where you have to give them a, a couple simple things to focus on in order to start building the confidence by having better at bats. And that's all they're looking for is see the ball better, feel better, stay shorter, feel like they have a chance to square a ball up and if they do square a ball up you hope to God that it finds a hole because that's the biggest thing to getting the confidence going. And when you're not their coach anymore is it hard to not want to shoot a text to them and give them a it is, little... but you know, I don't want to. I don't want to interfere in that regard because that's another that's, message for him. It's right? another yeah. message. It could play against me as far as you know. Well, Sites was texting me and jacking yeah. with me, and I was trying to do this. But so I just, you know, I've let it go. I, I have received some texts from some guys, but it hasn't been anything to do with mechanics or mm -hmm. anything like that. It's just been, we miss you. Right. Well, <laughs> you speak. Make, makes me feel good. Bo's been blowing up all day long. Big news. You know, George Brett, Royals Major League Baseball Hall of Famer, is interim hitting coach now. And we'll see where they end up going with this. But it's uh, it's been crazy. I know you've had a crazy day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just beginning, too. Oh, there you go. There's Kevin Seitzer right here on 810TV.com.